Hi, Zeppa here. Today, we're talking about spec weapons. I get a lot of questions for which spec weapon should Iron Man try to go for, and every time I mention the Dragon Warhammer, Bandus, or Saradamin Godsword, the conversation pretty much ends. But don't worry, I've got you low-level and low-budget gamers covered, as today I'm gonna list my favorite easy-to-get utility slash defense reduction spec weapons in old-school RuneScape. First up, we have the Bone Dagger. This item can be obtained from Nardok in the Dorgeshun Mines for 2000 GP. And the special attack can be used after completing the quest Death to Dorgeshun. The special attack of this weapon is called Backstab, and it has a guaranteed hit if you weren't the last one to attack the target. So, if you start your combat with a boss on the Bone Dagger special attack, you will be guaranteed to get past the accuracy roll, even though the dagger might hit a zero. This special attack reduces your target's defense by amount of damage dealt, similar to the Bandus Godsword's special attack. And this item has been used for example in TOA by a lot of popular streamers as a part of a insanely low budget setup when they were trying expert mode runs. If you want to have a budget version of the BGS, grab yourself a bone dagger. So next up we've got the Ancient Mace. This weapon can be obtained during the Another Slice of Ham quest, and it only requires 15 attack and 25 prayer to be used. The special attack uses 100% of your special attack energy, and it's mostly used by PK clans in the wilderness to drain the opponent's prayer points to zero to get the protect item prayer off. But on top of this prayer drain to the opponent, you can also recharge your own prayer points with it, and you can recharge your prayer points past your maximum. And this was very beneficial for me when I was doing the Inferno. So before every single run, I came to my POH and I specced with the weapon like this. And you can see I have 115 prayer. And if I use Piety, it will go even higher. So if I spec with it here, I have 119 prayer. If you have the Slayer Helm or max strength bonus, you will have even higher max hit and even higher maximum prayer. This is very useful. You should 100% use this item as a budget version for Seradom in Godsword. This is way much easier to get and you just need to do one quest and you're set. Okay. So last up, we have the Arc Light or the Dark Light. Dark Light can be obtained during the Shadow of the Storm quest. It's very easy to get and the special attack costs 50% to use. This special attack drains the target's strength, attack and defense levels by 5%, but it's doubled against demons. This weapon is commonly used to spec down Corporal Beast, but you can use it on any boss and especially on demons like Krill Tutcharoth in the God Wars dungeon or Cerberus or Abyssal Sire, it's very useful. It's a great budget version for your Iron Man. The requirements for the Dark Light are very easy, and the Arc Light, though, requires 75 attack, so it's more for the mid to late game accounts, but that's not too high, in my opinion, for the cost, which is zero. I definitely suggest you get one for yourself and use it every time you find it helpful. These weapons are not so commonly known and I often find people just waiting for the BGS or Dragon Warhammer which are great but somewhat very late game and pretty hard to get with the drop rates. So I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope that you found out a new utility slash defense reduction spec weapon for your account. Thank you very much for watching, have a great day, Zeppa out, peace!